Today I'll be showing you how to make a vintage cabinet. After cutting everything out, I'll start by gluing everything together with hot glue. Please be careful when using hot glue. cabinet and I'm going to glue three little pieces together. I'm going to glue the legs on. cabinet brown. Use some empty packaging to measure and make it fit. And we're gonna glue it on. And do the same with the other one. those small nails that came with this and I'm gonna cut a little bit off with pliers just to give it a better hold so those uh, miniature hinges were meant to go like this this one comes here and then you can just kind of close it up but I needed four of them so I did it this way and same with the other one and now we're gonna put this part on here so there was only eight nails and I didn't put one in here and in here so I can use those for the side just to give it some extra hold like this. Here I have some furniture nails and I'm gonna use that as the handle. I'm gonna take pliers and cut off the axis. And for some extra support, I'm going to put some hot glue on here, just a little bit. Like those uh, furniture nails, I'm going to give this side and this side the same look. So I'll just color in a little. little distressed look. I have some tanned acrylic paint here and I put it on a piece of cardboard. I'm just gonna take a little bit of paint and just start anywhere. The 
different kind of molds that I got from Walmart. And this is the package. And I'm gonna take hot glue and I'm gonna fill in one part. I'm gonna let it dry and after it's dry just pop it out and if you have too much you can just cut it for the cabinet that I'm doing I'm gonna cut it off like this and I'm gonna paint these two parts after painting this is how it's gonna look what I'm gonna do with that I'm gonna take them and put them in as many as you like and then after cutting it I like to just cut off a little bit to make it more straight and they fit better mm -hmm. 